Hey folks, Steve here. Hey, have you ever wondered what your personal web search history was? You know, I, uh, I actually think up weird stuff like that and wonder the type of searches that I have done throughout the years. And Google actually offers you a way to see your web search history, your personal history that you've done on Google. <clears throat> I'm going to show you how. It's pretty easy. Uh, first of all, you can see I'm at the sign in and it says web history. Uh, I'm going to leave you a link to this particular page in the description below so you can go in and sign in yourself. But I'm going to go ahead and sign in for myself so you can see this. Oops. All right, let's redo that. Yep, I'm human. I make mistakes. I know that's hard to believe. But anyway, now I am on my web history page and I have a lot of different items that I can look at my web history. One of the things I want to show you right here is really pretty wild is my total Google searches is 54,011 searches. That's pretty cool. I've done a lot of searches on the internet. Maybe you've done more. Uh, you'll have to go check your history to find out. But here's today. I, I did a, some searches for Dropbox and Blurred Lines and YouTube titles. Here's some of the searches that I made for yesterday. Over here in this left column, you'll have a chance to break it down. Your web searches, if you've ever searched for images, there's some of the images that I've searched for if you've ever searched for news, etc., etc. Uh, here is some video searches that I have made. Now let's say that I want to remove some of these items. Very easy to remove them also. Here's one I searched for. Believe it or not, this is a Peter Cetera video. I'm a Peter Cetera fan. I just hate that, uh, hate what I found out about him yesterday. And it's not bad. It's just the fact that I went and looked, uh, looked him up and he's 68 years old. And I'm going, oh my God, where is the time going? Peter Cetera. 68 years old. Oh crap. Father time, slow down for us all. But anyway, click this checkbox and I can click remove items. And it says you have removed one item from your history. So I can go back and you can do that for uh, any of these other things. I can click a box. I can remove that item. And that item has been removed. You're the only one that's going to see your web history. Uh, maybe the NSA will see it, see it also, but uh, this the, your history is not available to anyone but yourself, and you have to sign in to get it. So go check your history. Find out what kind of things that you were searching. It may make great ideas for um, making a video or, you know, some blog posts or just if you're just curious of what you've searched for three years ago. Okay, I hope this video is helpful. I'm Steve. Wherever you're at, I hope you're having a great day. God bless the USA.